an important day, a, a busy day for yourself. But before we get into the specifics, just just tell us a little bit about what it's been like for you. I guess you know how tough has it been to make some of the decisions and, and tell some of the players the things you've had to tell them. To. It's, it's always difficult for managers. I think uh, when you whether you're telling a 16 year old or, or, or whatever, it's it's uh, it's something that has to be done. And uh, you know over the last couple of months I've, I've worked out who I want to stay and uh, and that's why you know uh, today was there you know I wanted to, to move the club forward now and uh, that's why I discussed it with all the players today even the lads that are retained I wanted to discuss have a chat with them all. Um, has your mind been made up for some time on, on these decisions? Um, no, no I wouldn't say some time you know I think I think even up to the last couple of games I've had one or two things in my mind that uh, I wondered you know whether I was going to, uh, what I would do, but uh, the, the couple of games that I saw just you know ma made my mind up finally. I was, you know, finish my list off. We'll talk about some of the specifics then. Um, you know the players that you've put on the transfer list. Adam Clayton is the the headline one, I guess, because of the amount of games he's, he's played this season. There, what's your thinking there? Uh, well, I'm I'm looking at bringing midfield players in. Uh, I, I think Adams. Um, I would it, just because they've been on the transfer list doesn't mean that they'll go. They'll all, you know, if we don't have any inquiries, they'll, they'll all come back pre-season and fight for the place. It's just that the, the, the um, contract that was that the, the Adams representatives were looking for, we weren't prepared to to go to that extent. So, you know, if he if he's coming into the last year, it makes sense really to see if I can, you know, if they can get that contract somewhere else and we can get appropriate figure. I feel it's an you know it's tight. It's it's the sort of money that I can use to improve the squad really. So, but if he's not gone, if Adam's not gone, he's like everybody else, he'd come back pre-season, and it's up to him to show us in that pre-season time that um, he can get in the team and, and uh, you know try and get his position and then he's in the driving seat then going up to Christmas with his contract running out so you know it's, it's not really I wouldn't say any of the lads it's a, a full and final uh, it's just something I felt you know in Adam's case and I, we weren't to prepare to to uh, to uh, give him the contract that his agents offer, ask for and I think the best thing for all of us is to see how he comes back and how we are in that situation at that time. So if, if his demands change, for example, they, you know, there could be a way back for him here. I mean, did, you know, how, how highly do you rate him as a player? I mean, you well, would be a lot of I look at him. I look at, you know, we, we're signing players now, and I'm looking at the wages that we're offering the players that we're signing. And, uh, you know, there's a couple of offers we've made to play that I think are good. But, you know, whether they'll be accepted or not, I don't know. So it's just one of those, it's something that I felt that had to be done at this time. And we, we just have to cross the bridges when we come to them uh, with Adam and one or two of the other lads. I guess, you know, some fans might be a bit surprised by it, Neil, but, you know, you've, they've, they've got to keep the faith with you, I guess, in, in that decision. Well, it's just managers, you know, we've got, there's, there's, there'll be a few um, decisions, I'm sure, when, you, when you're talking about so many players and making decisions on them, um, you can't please everybody. And uh, and that's why you just have to get on with it. And, and, and that's what I've done. You know, I probably, like you say, Adams, I probably had more games than anybody else. Uh, I just feel, I'm looking at the midfield area, you know, I, I have my own ideas of players I'd like to bring in. And, and uh, that's, what I, you know, that's what I'm going for.